Hello and welcome to A Threefold Cord, the marriage ministry of Windsor Christian Fellowship. My name is Dale. This is my wife, Kelly. We're so glad you could join us today for another exciting devotional. So, wife of my life, what is our topic today? Well, today we're talking about division. Uh, and the name of the devotional is entitled, A House Divided. Our scripture text is coming from Mark chapter 3, verse 23, and it says, And if a house is divided against itself, that house cannot stand. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Well, you know, that's uh, very true because one definition of divide is to separate into opposing factions. So that tells us there that if our homes are full of st- our strife, we're into arguments all the time, and, and that'll break us into separation within on whether the circumstances are being spoken or unspoken, there's animosity between husband and wives then what we're ultimately doing is playing right into the hand of our enemy, Satan, who wants to divide the family. Because he knows if he divides the family and breaks down the family, then there's a separation. It's a domino effect. And when the family, the ultimate thing, to be divorced and to be ruined and everybody's unhappy except him. Mm, that's, that's good. Yeah, um, statistically, uh, there's statistics show that people are really no more happy after a divorce than they were before. And so where they thought they were, you know, getting out of difficult circumstances and they'd end up happier, then it really, it just opens up a whole new can of worms and a different set of unhappy circumstances and still ending up unhappy in different ways. And so we really do have to um, recognize the enemy and his tactics and stop allowing him to divide uh, us and tear down our homes. You know, he wants to divide the home into total uh, annihilation, separation, and end in divorce. But of course, What we want is what God wants. He wants happy families and strong families and enduring marriages. So we just need to be on guard for what the enemy is trying to do when he comes in trying to pit us against one another. Instead, we need to stand strong together and fight against him. Amen. 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 Let's pray. So, Father, we do praise your name and thank you for reminding us, Father God, that you would have us be together. The enemy is the one who comes to destroy and tear down the fabric of marriage. So, Lord, we praise you today for it. In Jesus' name, amen. All right. Well, thank you for joining us this week. And don't forget to check out the devotional in its entirety by clicking on the link below. So thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next week. Amen. Nice. Okay.